Hello everyone, in this video we are going to demonstrate a very simple and effective treatment method that can be utilized for patients who complain of pain in the interscapular region. Now what is important and interesting to note is that all the pains that originate in the interscapular region are not always coming from the dysfunction of the rhomboids or the trapezius muscle. It is quite a possibility that the costotransverse joints, that is the joints between the ribs and the transverse processes of the vertebra can become dysfunctional and painful. This dysfunction of the costotransverse joint can in fact be secondary to the painful muscle spasms of the paravertebral, that is the paraspinous and the interspinous muscle. The technique that will be demonstrated is going to help increase blood flow in these regions thereby relieving pain and stiffness. Now to quickly assess whether the costotransverse joint are a dysfunction or not and whether these are the source of the interscapular pain. Let's say for example, we want to check for the right side. So the, what the therapist is going to do is, the therapist is going to make the patient lie down in the prone line position and is going to stand on the head end. And now with the right hand, the therapist is going to stabilize the laminar groove of one side and then is going to apply a posterior anterior pressure to the costotransverse joint. And if these joints are dysfunctional, they are going to be painful and tender as well as less springy to this force of the therapist. Now to treat the interscapular pain originating from the costotransverse region, the therapist is going to make the patient lie down in the supine line position and then the therapist is going to ask the patient to elevate both the shoulders up to 180 degrees. And now without moving or producing any movement of the head, the therapist is going to instruct the patient that do not move your head and try to look up towards your hand. And now the therapist is going to instruct the patient to maintain this position for about a minute or two. This position is going to increase and improve the blood flow in the paraspinous and the interspinous muscle, thereby relaxing them and restoring the costotransverse joint mobility. This can be called as the superman exercise that is it's like the superman flying in the space with the back turned towards the earth. Do try this treatment method as a home exercise and prescribe it to the patients who are chronic mobile and laptop users and also those who sit in poor postures for a prolonged period of time. I sincerely hope that the information and techniques that we are sharing in this series are going to be helpful for you all. Do keep motivating us with your comments and feedback. See you all in our next video. Till then, keep learning, keep sharing and stay connected.